Hi YouTube. Uh, here's just another video. <clears throat> I want to show my um, water revitalizer, I guess is what you call it. It's um, something that Johan Grander made, a man named Johan Grander. I'll leave his name in the in the box and links to his videos. Um, I had found his patent in the past, I don't know how, but or found a schematic of a of what his system looked like anyways. I think I did. Um, or maybe just figured it out with logic, but can't remember. But there's a fella named uh, Real Verbs too. Um, I'll leave the link there as well for his channel. But he explains this as well, uh, how to do this. But um, apparently, uh, you get really, really different water when you uh, run your water through this system. And basically, all it is is a hose and it run, runs through some magnets and they're basically uh, phase conjugated so here we have uh, the north end of this magnet and I have two magnets together um, so basically this is one magnet and this is another magnet but um, the north end is this side the south is this side now on this magnet the south end is this side and the north end is this side and it keeps continuing like that <clears throat> down the line so basically these two magnets are smashed together at the south poles <clears throat> and these two magnets are smashed together at the north poles and these two are smashed together at the south pole smashed together at the north pole smashed together at the south pole smashed together at the north pole and this is the south side so everywhere there's a spacer here, the souths are coming together here, the norths are coming together here, souths are coming together here, norths, souths, norths. So it, it alternates. <clears throat> now basically, um, these spaces are in here to keep it lined up uh, while I was putting it together. Um, if you're going to make one of these, I'll suggest that uh, you make all the pieces and uh, make sure they fit together and then put it together because you're going to be holding magnets down holding them together um, as you put it together. I put this bottom piece in a vise um, and put these two uh, rods in. These are just threaded rods with screw or nuts on them but uh, and washers and then just uh, screwed it together so it's very sturdy I'm gonna make I'm gonna box it up I'll make sides up for it but I wanted to make a video of it before I did now you just hook this up to your tap and you flow your water through it now um, real verb the real verbs um, he had a system I think I remember where it was continuously flowing a continuous loop which I think is what I'm gonna do I have a, um, a rain barrel here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill it with water with it first and then have it siphoning up and flowing back down into the and falling back down into the the container so that it's going to cycle it but anyways that's just another idea but what this does is uh, revitalizes the water uh, apparently our water is um, isn't treated well. That's how Johann Grander um, explains it. But I'm going to use this and corporate companies in Germany use these and they have amazing results with different cleaning solutions and growing and other healing effects and things like that. Um, too many to be ignored. Too many testimonials to be ignored um, from big companies actually. And this, this idea doesn't catch on though. <clears throat> but um, they just flow the, the water through it. This will be in their basement or wherever their water intake is. They have a, a bigger version, you know, with a bigger pipe. Um, but basically it's just flowing into Grander's unit. And Grander's unit has no electrical input, um, no filters to change. It doesn't get opened up 
and he says his secret is magnets and it's a trade secret but this is the only way uh, it could really be and I do remember seeing um, a schematic of his before somehow I found it on the computer but anyways there it is wanted to uh, show that to the world um, if you have any questions on how I made it or anything like that um, please feel free to ask but I'll leave some links in the box um, for more info on Johan Grander and this this concept it's very very interesting uh, what I'm going to be using this for is I'm going to be um, watering some plants I'm going to do an experiment uh, it's that time of year I'm going to plant some plants and I'm going to have an experiment in a control group and see the difference uh, it makes with this water but anyways until next time I'll uh, talk to you later YouTube uh, while I was putting it together um, if you're going to make one of these I'll suggest that uh, you make all the pieces and uh, make sure they fit together and then put it together because you're going to be holding magnets down holding them together um, as you put it together I put this bottom piece in a vise um, and put these two uh, rods in these are just threaded rods with screw or nuts on them but uh, and washers and then just uh, screwed it together so it's very sturdy I'm gonna make I'm gonna box it up I'll make sides up for it but I wanted to make a video of it before I did now you just hook this up to your tap and you flow your water through it hi YouTube uh, here's just another video <clears throat> I want to show my um, water revitalizer I guess is what you call it it's um, something that Johan Grander made a man named Johan Grander I'll leave his name in the in the box and links to his videos um, I had found his patent in the past I don't know how but or found a schematic of it of what is system looked like anyways I think I did um, or maybe just figured it out with logic but can't remember but there's a fella named uh, Real Verbs 2 um, I'll leave the link there as well for his channel but now um, Real Verb, the Real Verbs um, he had a system I think I remember where it was continuously flowing a continuous loop which I think is what I'm going to do I have a, um, a rain barrel here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill it with water with it first and then have it siphoning up and flowing back down into the and falling back down into the the container so that it's going to cycle it but anyways that's just another idea but what this does is uh, revitalizes the water uh, apparently our water is um, isn't treated well that's how Johann Grander um, explains it but he explains this as well uh, how to do this but um, apparently uh, you get really really different water when you uh, run your water through this system and basically all it is is a hose and it run, runs through some magnets and they're basically uh, phase conjugated so here we have uh, the north end of this magnet now I have two magnets together um, so basically this is one magnet and this is another magnet but um, the north end is this side the south is this side now on this magnet the south end is this side and the north end is this side and it keeps continuing like that <clears throat> down the line so basically these two magnets are smashed together at the south poles <clears throat> and these two magnets are smashed together at the north poles and these two are smashed together at the south pole smashed together at the north pole smashed together at the south pole smashed together at the north pole and this is the south side so everywhere there's a spacer here the souths are coming together here the norths are coming together here souths are coming together here norths souths north so it, it alternates 
Now basically um, these spaces are in here to keep it lined up.